I'm very pleased to welcome and thank all of you for coming to the Nobel Prize Dialogue Tokyo. Today's dialogue focuses on the topic, the future of intelligence. The philosophical understanding and the scientific understanding, they have to go together in tandem. Every time we have a, a computer revolution, we change the way we interact with computers. And now it looks like we're at another transition point. We're moving into an age where we're going to be, first of all, talking to it, conversing, and it'll be much more of a conversation rather than a question-answer. I think meetings like these are great, specifically because they are across disciplines. Uh, I'm a chemical engineering student. Interesting, brain science. I think the Nobel Prize dialogues are a lot of fun, but most of all, I hope they encourage young students to get really excited about science and go on and do great things. It's a great event. I have come from uh, India. It was a very great chance for us. So we are happy attending this. Yeah, I, I found this dialogue very, uh, very uh, relevant. Uh, and very informative uh, and very thought-provoking. The question is whether one day a robot could be joining you, the ranks of the Nobel laureate. Let's hope these robots are interested in receiving a Nobel Prize. Ah. <laughs> For science to be understood and respected in society, it's necessary that scientists communicate what they do and it's maybe more important now than ever. We use machines and, and forms of AI to augment and supplement our human intelligence and to compensate and make our civilization more effective. Well, I don't know what's going to happen in AI, but I do know it's going to have profound effects not only within the high-tech industry, but for all of society. It's one of the most exciting fields of human endeavor.